Just chilling Maya P and welcome back to my channel. Today, as you can see, me and Angie are in the car like always. <laughs> I don't have the wrong guys. I are you talked okay? about spit. Anyways, we are downtown right now. It is Tuesday and Tuesdays, Wednesdays, those are the days we usually spend together because that's when we're both off of work. So yeah, we're downtown. We're trying to figure out what we're gonna do because we're not sure yet. All I know is I'm hungry and we started back eating right today and the first thing i said when we got down here was i wanted a donut <laughs> i forgot that quick i forgot that quick i want a donut because we don't have a krispy kreme in town so i was i was wanting a donut but yeah we're about to figure out what we're about to do we're not sure yet so we will catch up with y'all when we figure it out Okay, y'all, so we just got back into town after hanging out with our nieces and nephews and his mom and Skyla and all them. So right now, we are at Walmart and Angie wants me to try this kombucha. I don't know if y'all have ever, I don't know if y'all have ever tried one of these before, but I tried one of Andrew's before and it was disgusting, but this one looked pretty, so I wanted to try it. But I just smelled it and I'm not looking forward to it. So, excuse the light, there's a truck blinding us right here, but they are kind of giving us some light, so. Okay, this is the guava goddess. <sighs> I need to stop smelling it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, I, it's I'm, good. No, it's not, I'm scared. <laughs> all kombucha smell nasty. They all nasty? All smell nasty. Okay, still gross. At least I swallowed this one. Last time I, <laughs> ew. No, I, there's no way I could drink this though. <laughs> that sounds good, man, I always drink it. No, this one wasn't as bad as the other ones you had me try, but this one, I think I tasted two of them now, haven't I? Mm-hmm, you tasted, well the other one that I could tell that you didn't like. Raw is real. Yeah, I spit it out in the parking lot. You tricked me. You talking about something that was so good. I don't know what's in this one. I mean, besides the guava. I think it has. What is this one supposed to be like? You know how some things give you energy, some give you well, something. Well, they all give you energy. No. But, uh, so, well, why am I drinking something for energy at eight oh three? Well, it's not like energy, but it's like I feel like I can't even fix my face right because it was nasty. Look at him just drinking it. Look at this new mirror I just bought y'all from <coughs> from J C Penny. Excuse you. Excuse me. It's a little compact mirror. My friend Tamara got me one, but I don't know where it's at. Somewhere in my car, but I've seen this one and I had to get it because it has a little M on it. But it's so cute and look at it. Y'all can see yourself. <laughs> and I got a devotional. You oh know yeah. What I'm he I'm got a to... new, can they see it? He got a new men's devotional, Bible Promises and Devotions from Barnes and Noble. I'm finna turn up. And then we just got some really cute new water bottles. Hold on. I literally can come up with an excuse for why I need a water bottle at any given moment. Like, I don't need another water bottle. I got rid of so many water bottles already, and here I am buying more again. Andrew got this blue one, and I got this pink one. Aren't they so cute? I need it. See, the, the reason I got this one is because they're smaller, you know? So they're easy to, to take with you. They fit, you know? That's the reasoning for these, but yeah. So we're about to go to the house chill because it's late and we've just been out all day with his um family and all that yeah we're tired so we're gonna go chill and we'll probably see you again tomorrow when we head to the gym at the gym brother it's been a minute since i recorded anything in the gym so no, I'm saying we in like swamp, baby. we'll see you tomorrow what's up y'all your girls here back on the cam it's been yesterday or the day before yesterday I don't know, the last time I talked to y'all was me and Andrew was headed downtown and we went to like the zoo and all that. But anyways, so today I just got off work, which is why I'm looking kind of rough. I haven't taken a shower yet. I'm about to go take a shower. But I wanted to show y'all that I went to Hobby Lobby because in case y'all didn't know, your girl has been wanting some waist beads for 
a while now. Like I've been posting and asking people where can I get them, who can make them, yada yada yada. Like I mentioned in my other videos and y'all probably seen that if you're not new to this channel. I hate ordering stuff online. So I wasn't really trying to order none online. I wanted to actually like go to someone who makes them, have them size me, put them on, all that. But the only person I found um, is in Atlanta apparently the only one that i can find um that's what they do a really good job and i just i don't live in atlanta <laughs> so i'm not trying to drive there you know unless i'm going there so yeah but anyways i just decided to make them myself i've been debating if i wanted to do this like make them myself or not but i think that's what's about to happen because i already went to the store your girl went to the the lobby now when halia was in town she got me some waist beads from i don't know what the woman's name is honestly but she um they went her and her mom to go get some waist beads or whatever and i didn't get to go with them so i didn't get to get like some that were like my size you know like not the stretching ones because i don't really want the stretching ones and i especially know that now because i ended up getting these ones which are really pretty as you can see you see they're really really pretty like these are two different ones i have a white and a pink pair but they're like really stretchy and I don't want stretchy ones mostly because <laughs> I put these things on y'all and they roll up right right in my rolls. That's, that's, that's not what I want. So I just decided to make my own and that's what we're going to do today. I really, these might work when I lose some weight maybe and my stomach's not as huge but right now they don't. So I'm about to do that. So this is what I bought. I bought cotton craft cord because I've seen this woman on YouTube her grandmother making some beads and she said that she used a cloth string i don't know what that is but this was the closest thing i could find and then i just got these kind of beads right here because i'm going for like a color that because i don't want to take mine off these are black and like a brown and black i don't want to take off my waist beads so i just want to be able to keep wearing them so i'm going to try this out and see if it works i probably will not record me doing it just because this is about to be trial and error and yeah but if it does work i'll tell you exactly how i've done it so i'm gonna do well i'm gonna take a shower and do that and then if I finish tonight, I'll show y'all the results, but that's all I got right now. Okay, y'all, these are my waist beads. They're like black and brown. I don't know if you can really see them because my bed's pink and the light in here is like trash. But they're like uh, black and brown looking color beads like that. So these are it. And they're pretty long right now because I um, I still have to put them around my waist and then cut them. But I'm about to go in the bathroom and put them on my waist. And yes, I still have not taken a shower yet. Because I was like, you know what? I'm just about to go ahead and do this. But I'm about to go in the bathroom and go ahead and like um, see how the beads fit. And then I guess I'll update you from there. Okay, y'all. So I finished my beads. And I have to say, I think they're kind of cute. <laughs> Let me show y'all. All right. So y'all ignore your girl's um, little punchiness. You know, you girl, you girl been slacking for two months three months but anyways we, we getting back right right now so these beads are gonna drop here soon but let me show you what we're working with so this is what we got going on y'all i'm feeling it they're cute like they're really cute i didn't want to make them too tight but i wanted them to be like tight enough to where like when i lose weight i can see the difference like if i suck in they like kind of fall so i wanted them to be like loose enough so where i could see the difference but yeah again they're like brown and black and I went with this color because I feel like it kind of um, will go a little better with like the outfits that I wear, you know. So yeah, I'm excited because they're so cute. And I've been wanting some beads for ever now. Sorry, I ran out of storage on my camera so I had to, you know, delete some stuff. But like I was saying, I've been wanting some beads for like ever now. So I'm so glad that I got to make my own. And yeah, depending on how these work out, I might make some more and maybe some different colors. So you know how like people wear them, if you know, like they stack them. I might do that. But when my camera was done, I went ahead and put on the other ones that Halia had bought me and this is what I'm talking about you see how like they like just sit right here which it's fine and all but like I don't like how they like roll up in this roll so I'll probably be wearing those but I like the idea of like stacking them so I'll probably make more like this depending on how this does over like the next month or so you know but yeah I might make a video on how I made them if anybody's interested or you can just like comment down below and I'll kind of give you the basics but yeah it really was not that difficult at all I literally had on a story time on YouTube and beaded the string like I did have to like here's the part that I cut off I had to like glue the end so like it would fit through the bead because like it kept fraying at the ends and it wouldn't like go through my beads but yeah I'll make another video on that if y'all would like but I'm gonna finally hop in the shower and I'll see y'all 
when I see y'all. Hey y'all, I'm just coming on to end the vlog because I just realized that I never ended the last vlog that I recorded. I'm currently in the middle of recording a new one, so check that out when it goes up but anyways if you haven't already be sure to subscribe to your girl's channel hit that like button and share this video with somebody who needs you know a little, little vloggy vlog in their life want to know how to make some waist beads any of that but yeah thank you guys so much for tuning in i love you guys so so so, so, so very much and i will see you in the next vlog bye